hands down, you know, one of the best tight ends in the NFL. So big, one of those every once in a generation tight ends. To miss the first couple weeks of the season and come in and have the impact that he was having, you know, before he unfortunately got injured. I mean, it was like every game, man, Gronk, 100 yards, man, touchdown. And I'm trying to compete with the best tight ends in the NFL, so I'm like, dang. And Gronk got 100 today again. And I got to go out there and, and, and try to get 100 too. I got to try to to go break tackles, you know, make guys miss. The Patriots definitely thrived with him this year. Their stats with him and without, it's a it's a tremendous comparison. Is he one of the biggest reasons why you think this offense kind of started to click today? Definitely. I mean, just having him back just opened up the offense tremendously. Last year with Rob Gronkowski in the lineup, the Patriots averaged 417 yards of offense per game. First Without Tom Brady's security blanket, they averaged just 351 yards per game. And it's amazing to me how many times he's completely covered and Tom still just rifles it to him and how many times he comes out with the ball. Rob, he is a guy that, he's kind of a dying breed. He's a tight end that can block and pass or see. He is such a big body, really, really dangerous. He's an overall tight end. He can block, he can run. You know, for a tight end, he's a freak. Way to go, way to go, Beach. Hey, watch this beautiful move. Hey, ain't a right to slide to that slap. Let me teach you how to eat. Let me teach you how to eat. How to marinate the meat. Let me teach you how to eat. It's a culinary chain. Let me teach you how to eat. It was a great call because we won. <laughs> Let me teach you how to toast. Let me teach you how to toast. Make a bloody red roast. Let me teach you how to toast. Be the perfect party host. Let me teach you how to toast. I don't even know what to do. I saw him. Let me teach you how to eat. Uh, which, I mean, uh, 